What's poppin' everyone? It's Big Bad with another video. Today we're gonna show you how to download mods. So you're just gonna wanna look up Melon Loader BTD6 on Google, and it should be the first link that you click on. Um, is called Hemi Semi whatever you see it. Um, so from here, you wanna download this link right here, the mod helper and Melon Loader. Um, now your computer will probably say that they're unsafe or whatever, but they should be safe. Everyone has a good time with them doesn't seem any problem so check on your downloads make sure they're good and going i had to actually make sure to confirm one of mine so that'll do it then you want to go to steam where balloons is and locate the files through there um, or if you know how to do it without steam you could just go to your balloons folder and then from here you want to you want to go to your download folder um, go to where you downloaded uh, the melon loader and mod helper and then you want to extract it as I'm doing right here. Extract Melon Loader into the Balloons folder, just like I did. Um, on mine, it said replace files, but that's because I already done it before. If you are re-downloading it, you just do that. And then as you can see from what I just did, you just want to open up the game from there. Don't install Mod Helper anywhere because there is nowhere to install it. Right now, um, the game is loading up Melon Loader for the first time. It's creating a mod folder and stuff like that. Um, which is actually going to be the next thing you do. You'll see in a sec. Um, once it is loaded up, you're going to want to exit the game because now the mod folder is created and the mod helper is very important. So from here, exit the game. And then you take the mod helper file. You'll see in one sec. In fact, let me wait real quick because I recorded this before the audio. So you take the mod helper uh, file and put it into the mod folder in um, the balloons folder that you were just on. And um, that mod folder, like I said, was just created, so you know which one it is. Um, and then from here to download mods, the main way is going to be in-game from here. Uh, so once you start up with the mod helper, there'll be a mod menu in the bottom right. You can browse mods by pressing on the bottom right again. You have things like place anywhere, ability choice, boss pack, a lot of these we used before, Ultimate Cross Pathing, you guys know. I'm going to download that real quick, show you guys what to do. Um, so when you download it, it's not going to be loaded into your game right away. You're going to have to restart after downloading any new mods or updating them. Anytime you um, change anything like that, you have to restart for it to take effect. Um, here's the temple base that we've been running lately. Um, and then let's get the unlimited tier, fifth tiers as well. And let me show you guys what I mean. So... We're going to restart now the purpose of this was because a lot of you guys have been asking me how to download mods and stuff i know there's some videos out there but just in case maybe there's something in there that's wrong or whatever um or not wrong but like outdated i should say um then this one should be fully updated as of the release date of this video it should work as of the release date i can't say anything for the next update um, if it doesn't work, I should probably I'll probably um, remake this video and link it hopefully. So, anyways, let's check out the mods we just downloaded. So, sandbox mode. There we go. And um, so, let's put down a dart monkey, and we can cross path it now, as you guys see. And it's obviously OP. Not only can we do that, we can do two of them because we have unlimited tier fives. Um, so, let's just send out a bad real quick and show you guys that it really is cross pathed. <laughs> there it is the power of mods so as this is going um, one thing i want to a few things i want to say is that um you could your account could get banned essentially or flagged for um cheating essentially which makes it i think it makes it so your account is locked a lot of features you can't use um so don't use any online features when modding like races and um, ranked things because then you'll get banned. I heard that increasing your monkey money and um, your knowledge and stuff um, also does that. It ha I don't think it ha has happened to me yet, but that could happen. So I personally run it on a different Steam account. So I would do that if I were you if you want to be perfectly safe. And then the last thing is on the website that you download it from, they have the... Um, link to the uh, discord for modding so if you need mods that aren't on mod helper they might be there they also have a different discord and the fire rate changer and speed hack great mods so anyways that's going to be the end of the video um, let me know if you guys have any more questions or anything i'm probably going to link this anytime i do mods or anything 
so that you guys um, know how to do it and stuff from that video so hopefully this was helpful if there's anything i need to correct let me know i'm pretty sure all of it was right if anything was too weird let me know um and i'll, I'll be happy to clarify anything shout out to ninja kiwi and shout out to all the modders i'll catch you guys in the next video bye